You guys, look how rainy it is. It's been rainy all day long. Uh, and look, over there with all the lights on, that place is empty. I don't know why the um, leasing company, when they clean out after someone moves, they leave on all the lights in the apartments. It's one over here, you probably can't see it, but a tiny bit to this where my where I'm pointing. I don't know if you can see that, but those lights are on too. It's just like why? Oh god, you see that when it rains down here, oh my god, it just goes crazy. You guys, I cleaned up the room today. Uh just dusted in here, cleaned the mirror, um, dusted the blinds, changed the sheets um that are on the bed and the blanket washed them and changed out vacuum it don't look like it doesn't it don't it doesn't look like i vacuum but i did vacuum um but i've been also walking all over the floor again but i did vacuum and then i kind of organized all this stuff over here you guys i've been telling you that i pretty much really um i need a workspace a real workspace like i used to have i miss my home office but um i tried to break this stuff down and actually just see what i need see if i can purge some of this stuff but come to find out actually i can't i need all of this stuff so um i won't be able to like really do anything with this stuff here and then i did organize my closet a little bit uh, let's see let's open hold on oh wow okay so that's kind of a little bird's eye view of um yeah yeah a little bird's eye view of my closet super organized so proud of me <laughs> Oh my goodness, I just noticed the blinking light. Why is that light blinking? Oh, I see a blinking light. Oh. You guys probably can't see that really good, but I don't know what that means. Let me turn on some lights around here so you guys can see. I wanted to show you guys something. So, Jenna JP, she uses this brand of um, car freshener, but it's like a spray. I've tried my best to find the spray, but I couldn't find the spray. Uh, we bought three, one for my car, two for hubby's truck, and definitely he put his in his car already and did not put mine in my car. Why? I don't know. Uh, but, yeah, so um, I think it's uh, supposed to be a really good air freshener, car freshener. Um, oh, wow, thunder. <laughs> but, yeah, so I can't wait to try that out. And then this is really what my car usually always smells like. This particular Febreze, Febreze, <laughs> Auto Midnight Storm. I love this one, you guys. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. And uh, but it just seems to go away really quickly, and especially down here in Alabama, they dry out really fast. I guess because the car is always like at least 100 and some odd degrees or whatever, or degrees, not grease. <laughs> so, yeah, I scheduled to get my nails done tomorrow morning. I was not able to wear my little outfit that's real cute. That kind of matches this, so I may run this little design bag and go and get my nails done in the morning at 9 a.m. Not sure if I'm taking you guys along with. Um, and you guys, guess what we got? Unboxing. Well, it's pretty much already unboxed. Hubby decided to do an unboxing unofficial un unboxing by himself without you guys so you guys say something to him about that in the comment section because he um definitely should have waited on you guys and showed you guys the unboxing now Keurig is Keurig you seen one you seen them all <laughs> and uh yeah this particular one is ours. I'm not a big coffee lover. If you've been here a while, then you know I'm already a tea gal. Uh, but I'm super excited. 
we're having family come in town pretty soon and so they drink coffee and we wanted to make sure we could accommodate them but i'm also hoping that they know how to work this thing because i sure don't and uh they're gonna be on their own making coffee but i'm thinking everybody knows how to use a keurig at this point in life um yeah visit keurig.com or yeah slash new to enjoy 50 percent off beverages oh, okay let me tell hubby that uh so yeah unofficial unboxing i don't even know how to work how to work this thing how do you oh okay oh 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 there it is okay mm. <laughs> all righty there so that's what that's looking like on the inside and um you push this oh uh oh wait a minute i'm about to break something oh god and then got this little here doohickey thingy oh oh, oh it comes all the way off see this how much <laughs> i don't know anything about these carrots um but i think i can make tea in them too probably and then I saw one a long time ago. I was at a conference and you could make, they have one where you can make soup, little K cup soups or whatever. So, um, yeah, bring in spanking new, haven't used it. Yeah. Oh, cute. Some 50% off more. Oh, register. Now we were good for registering our appliances that we get we registered the uh, air fryer over there and when oh actually our air fryer was acting up on us and we contacted them and they took care of it with uh because we registered it i believe like warranty so um i'm gonna make sure hubby sees this because i think he thought this was trash and then you guys i have another unboxing that i want to show you and share with you really quickly um, I've had this particular makeup for probably like a year now. And, um, I did Christmas in July last year and this year, but I bought this when I was in Michigan. We have the Christmas tree shop. Um, I bought this like a year ago. Yeah. Last July. So it's been a year and, um, the Christmas tree shop is in Michigan and I forgot that I had this when I packed up. Um, I never unboxed it and opened it. So we'll open it together. I'm looking at Hot Mess Express, y'all. Forgive me. That's pretty much why I've been off the camera the most. <laughs> because girl, you girl, is looking a hot mess. But y'all love me and forgive me, honey. Because I need to really rebraid my hair and, like, do something with my edges and all kinds of stuff, child. But not today so but anyway let's unbox this little makeup situation and show you what i got from the christmas tree shop last year it's been a whole year i hope this stuff's some good y'all it was only oh that was the big thing last year it was 8.99 on this side and then also on the back side it was labeled a dollar 99 and so i challenged this at the counter and got it for a dollar 99 and uh yeah i was really happy that they accommodated me i forgot about that but i've had this for like i said over a year hold on I'm just gonna prop you guys up right here. Oh, Jesus, that scared me. Woo! Okay, you guys, so I don't know what that noise is, but it always does that when it's raining out and storming and thundering. And I hear alarms and everything, and so. Oh, oh my god i'm seriously super scared i always hate when this happens especially like at three in the morning when it happens and oh my god like now i hate when it happens my hubby isn't here to rescue a damsel in distress y'all y'all saw me jump up <laughs> oh my god let me calm down okay Woo! Ciao. okay all right so this is called best in complex kit Bella Pierre Cosmetics. This might not be the best angle, but it definitely helped me. I needed to jump up off my feet, honey. <laughs> so yeah, this is, um, it looks like there's a foundation, a highlighter, and blush. And then you get the brush there. Kabuki, mini, Kab Braca, mini Kabuki. 
Bronca Mini Kabuki Brush. Ciao. Oh, that was a lot. <laughs> Couldn't even get it out. All right, so let's open it up and unbox it. Make sure it's nothing in my nose. <laughs> so, yeah, this is the most awkward position. Forgive me, but I can't find my little um, blog stand. So, yeah. Sorry. So ratchet. <laughs> so this one is the mineral found mineral foundation. Bella Pierre mineral foundation. Let's see. There we go. Right here. It says mineral foundation. Okay, now I hear some alarms. Some more alarms. But it's ivory mineral foundation. And I'm trying not to be a scaredy cat. And then this one is the blush here. Um, Bella Pierre mineral blush. Dessert rose. <laughs> Desert rose. <laughs> That's one of my words that or two of them that always get mixed up. Everybody have some of their words. Dessert and desert. That's mine. Okay. So whichever one it is, that's what this what this is. And then put that there. And then this cutie patootie, cutie patootie champagne highlighter. Bella Pierre champagne highlighter. Adorable. Mm -hmm. And then the Braca, what do they call this thing? Braca Mini Kabuki Brush. Okay, that's what we're working with, Kabuki Brush. Let's see. Squeeze it out there. And that's, that is super duper soft. Super duper soft. Nothing's on it, I don't think. Oh, yeah. Brand spanking new, it shouldn't be anything on it. Super soft. Oh my God, it's so super soft, you guys. Okay, nothing on the bottom there. Put that there, right there, in your face. So let's open up this mineral foundation. I'm not a big foundation girl, although I did buy a liquid foundation recently. And this is what the foundation looks like alrighty there oh let's see I don't know how to even work this thing but do you, know, you supposed to take this thing okay so moving on we'll move on to the next <laughs> the blush Rose blush, a uh, desert rose blush, okay, and then the highlighter. Highlighter, How do you open it? here it is. There, let's see. Oh, look, super, super pretty highlighter. Let's see what that'll look like there. Mm. Okay. All right, highlighter, come on through. Okay. Looks cute, pretty in person. I don't know how it's coming on, off across this camera, these uh, YouTube airwaves, but definitely. Wait a minute. Hold on. Let me hold my arm up. <laughs> Ugh. See when I hold. Okay, now it's better. All right. Because, oh, okay. Let's do this. So my, you know how when they put that thing on your arm and then you hold your arm down and your veins pop out? Okay, that's what I got going on there. So, oh, it won't let me, hold on, let me hold my arm up again. <laughs> Sorry, you guys. Okay, let's see, a lot better, okay. All right, whatever, I think you get the point. So, that's really cute. I can finally throw that little situation away. Now, how do you get this to come out? Oh my God, I'm gonna have to, going to uh oh 
Now I was gonna go on YouTube and try to figure this out. Look at this. It's just a little oh uh oh a little what what do you call this? This thing. Some type of sticker to cover this up. So I guess it won't spill out all over the place, but we have some there. No need to waste them out of my whatchamacallit there. So that's that. Okay. Okay. Let's see. It's looking real cute in person. I don't know if y'all getting that vibe there. If okay, hold on. Let me hold my arm up a little bit. Come on. Bangs. <laughs> I have really good bangs, okay. So, alright. Too cute. Okay. And then let's do the foundation. We'll take this off here. And I think you guys can see it there too, probably. Oh, wow, that's gonna be real light, hold up. Okay. I don't know if you guys are getting that. It looks really smooth. So I'm gonna play with this and see how it works out for Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, there we go. So, of course, um, it's just on the back of my hand. It's not, like, on my face, so we really can't tell. But it looks like it's going to be a cute little combination there. Not sure. We will find out. If that foundation is, like, not doing its job, I definitely will not be wearing it at all. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they want us to take cover, but where? Where am I taking cover to? See those clouds, y'all? Ooh, we. Uh uh. I don't know what's beyond all that, but Lord. Yeah. What's going on? That's what's going on. I'm going to discontinue using my skin tag oil and just go ahead and purchase the other brand of skin tag remover situation, whatever the product is, because this really didn't work. I think it may have like started shrinking them, but it, it really didn't work. They're not really gone. They didn't slough off or they were supposed to flake off. They did not flake off as promised. I don't know if this may work for you, but it didn't work for me, so we're going to discontinue. I'll pop a picture of before and after of what on the screen of what the skin tags were looking like when I first started using them versus what they look like now, before and after. Okay, so you see that really didn't do too much. I don't know, you know, like it's been over a month, well over a month, probably a month and a half, six weeks or so and nothing. And I was pretty consistent with this. I, I could have been a little more consistent with it, but they said something like slough off in days. No, it's already been weeks and it hasn't, nothing has happened. So we're going to move on to another brand um, and I will announce that other brand when I start using it. You guys, I didn't. I don't know if I ever have shared with you that I love blueberries, especially frozen blueberries. And um, the reason why I love frozen blueberries is because, for one, um, I like to chew ice. I have not been doing that as much because my blood is not low like it used to be. Sorry about that. Um, but I love frozen blueberries because they kind of, it's like a little snack. And, oh my goodness, they're just the best. Coming right out the freezer. And, mmm, so delicious. Mmm, mmm, mmm. It's like a snack, a super snack, a super food snack. And, mmm, they just do the trick kind of keeps me from eating the ice and um that snack and they're just so good it's like a um frozen popsicle 
like a blueberry popsicle. Oh my goodness. They're real simple. Just freeze them. Wash them off, of course, and then freeze them. Um, so good. <laughs> and usually what I do <clears throat> is I will eat about like 15, 20, or 25. <laughs> this is a lot, but that's what a snack is for me. Like a cup, basically, a cup full. So, and it kind of holds me over, but super delish. You guys should try it. You won't be disappointed. I promise. Okay, you guys, guess what? Another unboxing that Hubby did without you is some kind of, um, he won something at work. Some kind of giveaway. He came in with a really big old box. It stood up like about this high here and this wide. And it had all kinds of goodies in there. What's that? Oh, that's important. Let me put that over there. But anyway, so um, it had like little Vienna beef sausages. And then we had, we got these little peppery things. And hold on, let me just get the stuff out and show you really quickly. Okay, so Chicago style relish. Okay, Vienna. And Vienna sport peppers. They sent us beef franks. I don't know what in the world we're going to do with these, y'all, because we do not eat these at all. Hubby doesn't eat meat, and I don't eat these. I hate hot dogs. Oh my God. I don't know. These might not be too bad, though. If they're like Polish sausages, I may try them, but I think we just, I don't know what we're going to do with them, actually, because we don't really eat meat, so I don't know. But then also we got poppy-seeded bread, the Chicago hot dog stand hot dog bun. Okay, it took a while for me to get it out, but I accomplished it. So there are eight poppy-enriched hot dog buns, and they sent us, well, that was us. Gave it to hubby. Look, <laughs> I just took his little gift. <laughs> they, it was two packs of um, hot dog buns in the box. And uh, yeah, thank you for your order. We did not order it. Hubby wanted. And I think this might. Oh, and hold on. Mustard. Mustard. What is a Chicago style hot dog without the mustard? Okay. So yeah, that is and what we got. Uh, everything is pretty much cold. This this stuff here is pretty much cold because it was in the freezer. These were in the cabinet. Um, hubby did his unboxing and just threw the stuff in the freezer and in the cabinet and did not show you guys. What's up with that? Mr. Just Vlogging Life, what's up with that? So, yeah, that's what we got. Memories from Chicago. And Lord knows we have memories from Chicago, y'all. We love going to Chicago. It's only four hours from Detroit, four hours from D, and we just love to go to Chi Town. Chi Town. We'll go to Chi Town in a minute. Yeah, four hours, less than four hours actually. Look at that. If you like hot dogs, but you can enjoy it. This is how hubby would enjoy his classic with no meat. This is what we do around here. And look at this. Looks like a recipe on deck. Okay, so I might even do a little short of this. Yeah, well, hubby, he got to get better at that. You come up in here with a box. It's called unboxing over here on Just Vlogging Life Street. You know what I mean? <laughs> okay, so hubby brought us dinner. And this is, what is this called, baby? A veggie? Veggie mix, bowl. Me veggie mix bowl from one of the local taco, taco um, restaurants or places. But so, yeah, I really did not want these black beans on there. I like the brown beans, the pinto beans. I really, this, I, I never have had, they, they messed up the order, y'all. So I'll vent and rant off camera. <laughs> but. I don't even never get avocado. Where's the um, sour cream? Oh, okay. I'm sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Let me um, calm it down for the vlog. <laughs> and then... <laughs> right. Baby, say hi to the vlog. Vlog dogs. They're not dogs. They're vloggy boos. Vloggy boos. Okay, so we got 
Yes, and I blame it on you that you unboxed without them. So they will check for you in the comments. And the Vienna sausage situation, I showed them that, that you also unboxed without them. So, yeah, and I don't know what in the world this is. What is this? What is this? What is this? Lord, have mercy. Yeah, I go complaining. I'm not going to complain. This looks like, what is it, queso? This look green stuff leaking everywhere. Um, okay, they gave us two of that. I don't even know what that goes with. What in the world is salsa verde? Oh, my God, the container, the presentation is horrible. Okay, so praise the Lord for food, for somebody not eating tonight. I'm so sorry. Yeah, I'm going to stop complaining. But Jesus, look, look at the bottom of the bag. Fix it, Jesus. Fix it. In the words of my good sissy Vita, Jesus, fix it. <laughs> fix me, so I'm going to stop complaining. Say grace, baby. Jesus' name, amen. Y'all, I'm going to enjoy my dinner with my hubby. We will see you guys in our next video. If you're new here, please hit that subscribe button. Set your bell to all. And uh, if you're an A1 Day 1, you're an A1 Day 1, we appreciate you for always rocking with us. I am Carla. This is here. And we're just vlogging life, y'all. This one hubby is having. Move your Nickelodeon, whatever that is. Pretty much the same thing. And we will see you guys in our next video. Pizza. Pizza. Well, oh, well, we greedy, okay? <laughs> Pizza also. I, yeah, we were confused about dinner tonight. But anyway, so yeah. One of them days. Peace huh? and peace. peace. No more rain.